Hello students, and so today I'm going to be showing you how to use Canva to create your own infographic for this uh, project-based learning for your favorite uh, or most interesting um, event to occur and that we've learned from this American Indigenous Studies class. So you can see I've made a few already and then here's one that I started and I will show you how to <coughs> start a design. So with this, you're gonna to have to use your Google account, the school Google account, to create it. <clears throat> so an infographic is pretty easy. You can do a poster, even a presentation if you don't wanna use Google or Microsoft PowerPoint. And then there's all other, a brochure as well. <clears throat> but yeah, I'll show you how to use the infographic, which is the easiest one and the most, uh, I guess, effective. Depending on what you want, and but I think it's good to use this timeline feature if you're doing a in order of events, I guess, to to include the start of a <clears throat> what was the most intriguing. So here we go. I will choose a template. Pew, 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 pew like this, we'll use that right there. And as you can see, you can <clears throat> edit all the different things. You can do the new text box right there and then do that one. I shall choose Battle of, actually, make this bigger. There we go. Oh my word. Technical difficulties. There we go. And delete that, I guess. And then let me see where I can uh, put their photos. <clears throat> I don't see anything that resembles that. Uh, but yes, so with this, oh, right there, oh, the bad lines. I know that's not a. Uh, oh, right there. Sue Homeland, boom. So you check that out. Professional. <clears throat> and then right there, add shapes, sizes. Your text obviously you can even add music to this and then your own videos and then with this you can also download it in a, into a pdf jpeg or even a gif if you felt daring but yes this is a good resource and you can get creative with it and <clears throat> let me see you can print it as well, download, share, present, and then present and record as I'm doing right now. But yes, this is a great resource, especially with a project like this, where you can be creative and do what you want. And then see, you can even upload your images, videos, and audio. But yeah, this right here, <clears throat> Canva, is good. Go for the free account and go under student. There's a uh, pros like the same, but you might have to deal with occasional ads. Well, that'll be it for now, and good luck.